Okay, Bob. Papa. Eh? Who is chasing you? Wait. What is it? What happened? Bob, God and I went to see the same man last night. This morning, the man gave us 40,000 naira. On our way back, I asked her to give me my own share. She gave me 10,000 naira. 10,000, Pops. Hold on, just relax. Whose contact was it? Kerem Wolo. Papa is my contact. You demanding 20,000 is outrageous. I think 15,000 naira would have been more appropriate. Pops. Without the contact, there will be no money. What is Pops there? You are right, Papa. <laughs> so, uh, gold. Papa. You have to bring out my own 10%. Then you keep your 20. Let her keep her 10. That settles the case. Let her keep her 10,000 naira. Papa. Mercy, what is it? Papa, I want to talk to you. I want to talk to you concerning what has been happening in this house ever since Mama died. For your information, I don't have any time for your useless conversation. But, Papa. Mercy, don't make me do something you will regret. Why are you always my problem in this house? Don't you look at your sisters and see how they behave. Papa. For the word of God says, what shall it profit a man to gain the whole world and loses his soul? Now get out of my face with that your word of God. I said get out of my face! Papa, don't say it. Look at that. What do you know about God? Every day this girl is preaching verses from the Bible to me. As if she's the one that wrote the Bible. You need to look at your sister that understand life. Every day you're here making life miserable for me. Huh? Eh? Useless girl. So holy magic. Just trying to spoil this my wonderful mood. Huh? Eh? for you to run the company, but you must first of all fulfill your father's wish. Which is? Marriage before CEO. Really? Yes. But mom, I'm too young for that. Says who? Even a 15-year-old boy runs the family. How is that possible? What happens to school? As if it doesn't happen where you're coming from. Just think about what I just said. Hello? Yes. Mercy, thank God you're back. Because we're going now, please take care of the house. Please, then, lock all the doors. Make sure no one enters it to take our things in. My sisters, don't 
don't you think it's high time you people stop this prostitution of a thing and allow Christ to enter your life? Please, Sister Bryce, thank you for your advice. Hmm? Go, let's go. But Sister, but Sister, it's okay, eh? take care of yourself, eh? Check out my girls, looking hot and spicy. Woo. <laughs> Tell me, where is it happening tonight? I'm going to a house. Mm -hmm. Daddy, I'm going to the village guest house. Listen, it doesn't matter where you go. The most important thing is make sure you collect your money. Because... It's all about the money. It is all about the Benjamin. Let me hear you say it. It's all about the Benjamin. You girls be safe. While I go in, um, I hope there's something to eat. Yes, Daddy. Beautiful. Bed rice. Take care of yourself. All right. Good night, Pastor. See you in the morning. Good night. Make sure you come back with goodies. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> hey, they go here now. <laughs> Don't be my fault now. That means they make a born beautiful girl. <laughs> Take them their hustle. What are you doing at home? Eh? When your sisters have gone out to hustle? Why are you so lazy? Papa, I am not lazy. I just got back from fetching water. Not that kind of lazy, you dumb head. I mean, why are you lazy in making money? Eh? Use your head, use your brain. Papa, the opportunity to make money has not come yet. When it comes, I will show you my real power. The opportunity comes knocking every day at your door but you tend to neglect it your sisters that are smart and intelligent they are out there making use of the opportunity changing their lives you're here every day just virgin maria that's what you want to be papa if prostitution is the only opportunity you're talking about then count me out of it because i will never be part of it i reject it in jesus name no problem No problem. Thank you, Mary. Papa, I went to the kitchen to dish out food to eat. But the door was locked. So? Did you lock it? Yes. Please, I'm very hungry. Really? You're hungry? Yes, Papa. Who prepared the food you want to eat? Cindy and Gold, my sisters. Ah, your sisters. Your sisters indeed. Did you ask them how they got the money to fix that food you're about to eat? Papa. Don't you Papa me? Didn't you say you don't want to be part of whatever they are doing? Now you want to partake in the proceed of what they are doing. It's not going to happen. Papa, I'm very hungry. I want to eat, Papa. I'm very hungry. Virgin Mary, or Mercy, or whatever they call you. There's no food for a lazy man in this house. Onye Lua Oriye. Eh? Onye Lua Lua Lacho Oloma. Papa, what you're doing is not good, though. Papa, what you're doing is not good. It's not fair. It's not good. Get one. Good day. What is your name? My name, my name is Aishi. Bogano Vesu. And I've been there, my people have been there ever since. So many years now. Yes. Ah, Bogasa, you fresh. So, I feel like you. Thank you. Bogasa, you come so much to the wish of mine. You go to the same thing. They were for the company, not for me, sir. When I come back. Just open the gate. Oh, I'll have open that to the test. Hello, Angel. How are you?
where are you? I would like you to come around. Oh yes, my son came back yesterday. Okay, see you soon. Bye. Hey, go, go, go. Good morning. Good morning. How was your night? Fine. I know everything is rosy. Everything is too. <laughs> Do the next program, you know what's that? <laughs> hey. 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 I want one of Finding a job in the city like you've, like you've always wanted. Yes, but I can't go to the city empty handed. No. Good. My plan is just for me to roll around and gather money. Once I have enough money in my hands, I'll go to the city and pay for a house. And put a stop to all this. Okay, I've heard you. Anyways, I'll continue praying for the forgiveness of your sins. Have you won the rest? <laughs> Papa lock up the kitchen, saying if I don't do what you and Cindy are doing, there will be no food for me in the house. Even though I thought of doing this, but my face won't let me. Please don't, okay? Don't worry, I'll get the kids from here so that you eat. This one, your face is like this. How was your night? It wasn't fine at all. What happened? That idiot refused to pay me, saying he thought it was a girlfriend boyfriend thing. What? Then why did you start coming back? Why didn't you call me? I've been calling, but you were not picking. Oh, my phone is inside the house. You should have called your sister. I did. Oh. Sorry, my phone was on silent. Do you know their house? Is that a Bakaliki guy that stays at Uwa Nima's house? Let's go there. Um, Nishan, okay. no. Go and get me my cutlass. <laughs> go down and get my cutlass. Make it fast. Go and hurry up. I'm coming. Be aware of what comes after you or what. Yes, the kitchen key. Uh, it's under my pillow. Let's go. Cindy, baby. You have to get your money. You have to. Hmm. We're going to go to the kitchen key. Connie man dies, Connie man there is him. Now we have collateral. If you want all these items back, you have to come and pay you. Else, we will sell them and get your money back for you. Oh, let's sell it. Selling it will be better. Oh boy. Rubbish boy. Who is he to come and do my daughter so free? And think he will go scot free? Ha! You never see anything. This is just. This boy.
Did the private sign. Okay. How was the food? Wonderful. That beautiful girl prepared it. Wow. I'm impressed. Is she a cook? What a funny question. She's a girl I brought for you to marry. Wow. Sorry, I don't get it. I picked that girl for you to marry when you return. So that you can inherit your father's properties. Trust me, that girl is from a very good family. And they are very wealthy. She has a business of her own. So, she's a good girl. Wow. This is the 21st century. How could a mother pick a wife for a son to marry? In this house, it's done. I can't have this discussion with you. Oh, I just can't get it. Son, you're walking out on me. Son! Papa, oh, please let me have 300 naira. I want to buy a sanitary pad. I am soaked. I don't have 300 naira. Okay, Papa. Please make it 70 naira. Let me get tissue paper. That one can help. We are this girl. It's your Are you insane? You have to take your time. I told you I don't have money. Go and ask your God. Ask him to give you money. Mm. Useless girl. I am soaked. And I have no cash on me. I am soaked. And I have no cash on me. What do I do? Mama died. Papa has been treating me poorly in this house. Oh God, please help me. I don't want to go into prostitution and serve you at the same time. Please, please help me to leave this village and hustle 
in a good fearing way. Please, Lord. Where are you coming from this time of the day? Uh, my old friend Frank, he came back from Jamaica yesterday. So I went to his house this morning to clean everywhere for him. Um, sorry, which Frank? Frank, one you must uh, thought so. The last one. One you must. Yeah. The one that just traveled to America to see her first. Uh, That's wonderful. Anyways, I was on my way to a meeting. Oh. You take care of yourself. Okay. Weed is awesome. This is what you call Jamaican sensimilla. Really? <laughs> Straight from Jamaica. Yes. I put it on my way back. But it's really nice. I was on my way to a meeting when I heard about your return. So I decided to come and see you first. Based on my relationship with your dad before his demise. I mean, you, guys are very close. you can say that again. So why did you decide to come back to the village? I returned to the village in search of a wife. I don't want to tell my brother who go my job. That's not some cambia. That is very tough for us. Because you don't like it. They don't want to. We have all kinds of young beautiful, succulent, chocolate, dark, <laughs> ebony, brown girls in this village. I will help you find them. <laughs> I hope you enjoy the week. Enjoyment is an understatement. I'm really having a blast. Goldie. Uh, yeah. Mercy. Yes, Papa. Come here and look in. I went to the meeting late, so I didn't get the whole agenda. But you left early? Yes. That was why I called you from the meeting. To inform you that I saw Amara, your friend, Neka's daughter. She told me that Frank, my son, that stays in Jamaica, came back home. So out of curiosity, I decided to go and confirm for myself. Behold, he was there. He said he came back to find a wife. Wow, really? Yes. So, what has that got to do with us? What are you doing here? Did I call you? Yes, Papa. I'm sorry. 
it was a mistake. I called A and B, so see yourself out of here. Go now. <laughs> Any of you to enter that family? We are sitting on a gold mine. Yes, we are talking a giveaway <laughs> for a money dollar dollar. Hey, <laughs> Benjamin, this is the Benjamin. How do we go about it? Um, I don't know, but I believe both of you can think of something. What am I might even say? Yes, if we're not, well, how do you go about it? You know, almost young. Don't want to pass on the street. I just don't care if you get in there. No, no one comes in. Don't worry, we'll handle it. Don't fall my hand, though. No, for what? That's a small thing. I want to do it. Frank and uh, that's my friend Ike. Hi. I hope you don't mind me asking, are you going to any place or any importance at all? <laughs> no, I not really. Okay, uh, we're both going to the bar around the corner, so uh, I don't know if you could join us. What do you want me to do? Wait, I understand your feelings. I know you can't do this our job. I know it's stressful, you can't do it. But can't you look for something better to do? Must you hog pure water? Is it not better for me to be selling pure water? Or what else do you want me to do? Do you want me to join you guys in this position of a thing you call a job? Stop it! Just get something else to do. I will support you financially. Okay? Look, I have an appointment to catch up with a man. I will see you when I get back home. Take care of yourself. Trish. Okay. So how was the trip back home? It was good. What's that your name again? Trish. Trish. How on earth? As good looking as you are. Except to marry the guy you barely know. I don't understand what you're trying to say. Alright, fine. 
let me get straight to the point. What I'm trying to say is that I am not in love with you and I can't get married to you. So stop fussing yourself, okay? I can't marry you. Moreover, I'm not ready for that now, okay? So stop fussing yourself. wedding. How on earth will I get myself into a package wedding? My father will kill you. Give me my money. Give my clothes now. Which clothes? Give me my clothes. I will you. I will hold you. I will hold you for you. Will you call me my clothes? I don't have money. Let me transfer money for you. I don't want transfer. I will tell you my father. I don't do with cash. I do with transfer. I don't want transfer. Transfer. That's why everybody will say transfer. When I, when I get home, I will not get my money. Leave my clothes. I will not leave your clothes. I'm, I'm, you want to hit me? Hit me, touch me, and you see what my father will do. Leave my clothes. Hmm. Hmm. Give me my money, oh. Uh, Give me my money. You are embarrassing me here. Leave my clothes, oh. You've not seen anything. I have not started with you. Give me my money. Give me my money. Okay. Mm -hmm. Move the here now. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. Up and down. Up and down. Give me my money, oh. Leave me now. Give me your hand. I don't have to leave you. You are put your hand in your pocket and give my money. Money is there. I said the money is there. There's no money here. You want money? No money. You want money? No money. Come, let me understand this. Have you seen the girl? Yes. And do you like her? I like her. Yeah. Like oh. her. You, you like her. How can I like or oh, be in love with a girl? I barely know. She's totally a stranger to me. And I honestly, thank you. Um, if you ask me, you understand my situation, you know? This thing they say about a rich family getting married to a rich family and uh, trying to secure a family business. Family business? So they say. I'm not ready for that. Okay. I just need to get out there and find myself so I'm not sure why. That's what I'm doing. How can I get myself into marry with someone that I don't love? It's a life. So I need to show you. I understand where you're coming from. Got it. And how was your outing? Oh, good. Obviously, you had fun. Yes, ma'am. Son, have you thought about what we discussed the other day? Yes, ma'am, I have. So? Honestly, ma'am, I can't get married to that girl. I can't get married so soon. Besides, ma'am, she's not my type. I've heard that all those village girls are after money. They are gold diggers. Son, what you're saying is that your mother can't make a choice for you. Is that? Mom, I didn't mean that. Whatever it is that you meant, if you don't marry that girl, I will never talk to you again, son. Mom. 
Mom. Mom, can you at least let me in? Mom. All right, fine. I'm so sorry, okay? Just call the girl, let's talk to her. Mom. Mom, can you please open this door? Fine, so sorry, okay? Just let me in, please. Mom! Hello, dear. Yeah, my son wants you to come around. I understand exactly how you feel. Okay? Why not come around, let's see, and hear what he has to say. Please, do this for me. Thank you. I will be waiting. Okay. Thanks. Oh. Yes, son. You know I love you so much. Mm -hmm. And I can do anything with you. Just to make you happy. I know. Tish. Steve. You're a very pretty girl. <laughs> and from what my mother has told me, you're a hard worker girl. But Tish, you need a man that will love, cherish, and cares about you. Not someone that will marry you because of pity. I can't be in a relationship that I don't love. I don't even dare to you. Just insult my complexion on a kind of person. No. Sure. Start from that. Too. I just want you guys to understand me. That's why I called you and my mother here today. Like I said, I can't get into a package relationship. I need to find my wife myself. Oh. And I'm Florence. Tish. I think he has a point. Oh, really? The point where your love had made you feel rejected? But why do you have to make me go through this when you are not sure if it's going to work out? Or do you think money is my problem? Or you think I'm here because of money? Oh gosh. Let me tell you, I'm not here because of money. And I think I'm done here. Trish, just calm down. Mom. Trish! Mom, leave her. Just leave her. Let her be.
these pockets. I think that's a good idea. You think? Well, but the thing is, you'd have to get to the village. But well, I don't know my way to the village. Moreover, I learned there are a lot of mosquitoes there. Let's look at yourself. You grew up not to kill about mosquitoes. Who well, since you know that there are a lot of mosquitoes there, why do you want a little girl? Take the city girl that we brought for you now. Ha! Take it. So I'm sorry, sorry. Can you go along with me since it's your father's life? <laughs> well, that won't be a problem, but there's a condition. I'd have to do the driving myself. The last time your driving was really horrible. You're not put out for that shit. That's how the driving is taken, bro. Oh, welcome to Nigeria, bro. It's fine. You will do the driving. So when do we go? Well, I'll get to speak tomorrow this night. And get back to you through the phone. Are you sure she will like the idea? Definitely she will. She was the one that said I should get married. So she has no choice. Yeah, your mom keeps cracking, cracking your who picks a wife for the sudden this is first century video. Yes, I'm just pissed off, you know. Say anything. Yes. You know what? I would like to make you go my house, move around that thing, and I assure you, say, or how we go and finish. Frank with your own. Well, I've not even done it with him. Well, you they tell me, say, you be virgin. I'm not saying I'm a virgin. I'm not. I can't sleep with you now. Okay, now I go help you, Sha. See, eh, after we do this thing, finish and everything legit, make I no lie you. I go tell Frank, say you be the hottest and the sweetest babe for this community. You sure? I go be, I go be a right hand man when he go come for you. Now what for you? You don't believe me? your name. Sorry, I was lost in thought. Uh, wait, so. I say, let me ask, eh? between you and your sister, who exactly is with that uh, Jamaica guy? <laughs> me? Why are you asking? You? I'm asking because I'm confused though. Some hours ago, I saw good and the Jamaica guy kissing and smooshing each other. What? Mm -hmm. Like, for real? Mm -hmm. What I haven't done with him? You have not done it with him. No, I haven't. Yeah. I know what I saw. I saw both of them kissing and smooshing each other. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you for this information. Mm How -hmm. would you do that? I still let me tell you because I know you saw you first. Thank you. Yeah. Bye bye. Come out here. Yeah, 
Good. Good. Stay away from Frank. Stay away from Frank. I won't warn you again. He is mine. Stay away from him. Sezu, you just heard me. I said he is mine. Stay away from him. Well, point of correction. Frank is not yours and will never be yours. You know why? Frank loves me and I love him too. Wow. He loves me so much. So do I love him. See love. I won't warn you again. Stay away. Stay away. Right. I want to say a big thank you to you for coming around and help arrange some stuff for this one thing. You're welcome, no problem. I like your coffee. Thank you. <laughs> mm -mm. You're fine, girl. I hope you taste as sweet as you do. I'm very sweet. You can go and taste it. Oh, so She's not going to back out. Hey! Really? Yes. See, there's something I will give to you. Hmm? Once you put it in her food, she will forget that you want to Just like that. Just like that, but it has to be on her for market day. That's three days from now. You put it in her food. Once she eats that food, eh? everything about that you want to we erase from her memory. She will not even take it. The Maka girl will be for you. Are you sure? I should be the first to you. You're sure? I need to. Which of you call for this meeting? Hi, Papa. Why? What is it? Papa, I saw us in tears. Crying and wailing. I think something bad is about to happen. So, I decided we should all go into prayers. Don't you ever call me for this kind of meeting again. Did I make myself clear? Okay. I saw blood flowing. Gold. We need prayers. Beautiful. Good morning. Um, where's the way to the street? 
<laughs> oh yeah, we just got in yesterday night. Um, my friend Steve wants a village wife, so who knows? Really? Oh, come on. Let's just let's just go along. We'll see you later, okay? Oh, uh, okay. Um, my house is just here. If you guys don't mind, you can just don't mind. Nice name. Anyways, I'm Steve, and this is my friend Dave. Messi, honestly, I do like you. Can we at least see you later, or maybe we hang out? Please, if you are looking for a hall to hang out with, I'm not the type. Excuse me. Today is the day I'm supposed to put this substance into my sister's food. so that she can have a change of heart. But I don't think there's need for that anymore since there's another new guy in town. <laughs> this one is taller and more handsome and he looks richer too. Well, she can have Frank for all I care. Why I have um uh, I didn't even ask of his name. I just pray we're going to see again as he said earlier. I can't wait to see him. Love you, forget Don't tell me you're pregnant. Sorry, boss. I am. But I told you not to do without. You said if I want to marry Frank, I have to do it with him. I didn't have any choice. What do you do now? Huh? Have you done it with Frank? No. I'm lost. If you go to me, I will go. I have lost all. So, you may say since you return from Jamaica, you say Jamaica will be here. And all these girls, they follow you bomba to bomba. I don't wonder why you no one nyash any of them. Do you not understand? But talk now, make her understand as your guard. Talk, I was tested HIV positive. Good. Uh, you mean H I V positive? Bring it for you. I don't bring that. See, in Jamaica, all these things they are not as serious as you. They feel like can't shake. Ah! Ah! Hey, Amara. Jesus Christ! Please, please help out. You want to shake it? Let's go. Messi, why are you always like this? 
I really do love you. In fact, I'm looking for a fight so I can get married. Why don't you at least just hear me for once? This is how you just see someone in the room. Who's married? Must it take a whole year to know somebody? My spirit acts you too. And I love you. Since the first day I set my eyes on you, Messi. Just, just show me the way to your house. So at least I can meet your father. Ask for who can this house do. Go See, I'm warning you, leave me. I'm warning you. I don't mean, I let me go and hustle like all that now. See, look at who's holding you. Hustle. See, if you don't give me money, you're not going anywhere. If you don't give me money, do you want to kill me? Did you bring me to your house to come and kill me? Well, eh? No, no, nah, there's no wait now. Nah. Just allow me. See, my man, can you promise me that I should come and work in our farm? I should promise to settle me the moment I finish. So allow me, let me just go and get the money now. Do you know how long I've been hearing this one promise me? This one promise Do you know how long I've been hearing that? What you? Your am... mates are there making money. Hey! What did I do to my friend? I told you I wanted Frank. Frank is who I wanted. It's a mistake. You deceived me. It's a mistake. Allow me to. You're not going anywhere. You will give me You're here. Not you will give me here. Hey. You will give me here. Sometimes we are the architect of our own destruction. As a father, I have never conducted myself well when it comes to the affairs of my daughters. I've always seen them as an instrument of making money due to my greed and selfish aggrandizement. I employ my daughters into things that are uncivilized Messi has shown that she is a civilized and decent girl. I've always gone against her. And thank God she stayed to her resolve and held on to her fate. But look at what I did to my other two daughters. Cindy and Gordy. Today, 
one is down with HIV and the other one pregnant by a stranger. Thanks to my daughter Mercy. Despite all my ways to convince her to join in my iniquities, she held on to her resolve and showed strong faith to her belief. First of all, I want God to forgive me for all my iniquities. I know it will be difficult for my daughters to forgive me. But I just hope they will find in their heart to do. Oh. 